Communication in the workplace is usually in the form of brief letters and memos addressed to an individual or a very specific group within an organization or to everyone. Examples are letters of transfer from one department to another, application for a study leave, letters of promotion, notification of a training program for workers, introduction of a new work process. All of the above examples fall under a category called internal correspondence. As correspondence is the term used to describe the exchange of documents either within an organization or between two or more organizations. The person who accounts for every correspondence that comes in or goes out of the organization is called the mail clerk. His responsibility involves recording information about mails received or sent out, the sender, the recipient, time of receipt or dispatch, the nature of the mail, whether urgent or confidential. The mail clerk updates a set of books which he uses to keep records of correspondence. One of these books is the Mail Inward Book, where he records all incoming mail. It is also called the Letters Received Book or the Incoming Mail Register. Another one is the Mail Outward Book or Outward Mail Register or Dispatch Register. It is used to record mails being sent out by post. Records in this book include the time of arrival of the mail, name of sender, the subject matter, the nature of the mail, whether urgent or confidential, and the destination, that is the individual, department, or branch office to which the mail is being sent. The postage book. The postage book is also called a stamp book. It is a record of the number of stamps in hand and the number of stamps used per day. It is used to record all outgoing mails sent by post, basically to track postage expenses. The dispatch book. The dispatch book is used to record outgoing mails sent through messengers and dispatch riders. That is, it is used to record outgoing mails sent by hand. The dispatch book serves as a proof of mails delivered by hand. Mails coming into an organization can be by hand, email, telex, fax, or post. Mails by post could be through a post office box or a private mail bag in the post office. In this case, the organization makes an arrangement to pick up mails at intervals from the post office, received mails, that is incoming mails, or mails sent out, that is outgoing mails, follow some routine steps before they can be distributed or sent out. The steps for outgoing mails include collection of mails from different departments, preparing mails, sorting mails, folding mails, weighing mails, stamping mails, and dispatching mails. So, in summary, office correspondence is concerned with the movement of mails, as in letters, within and outside an organization. For proper record keeping of mails, a mail inward book, mail outward book, postage book, and dispatch book are used. Both incoming and outgoing mails must be sorted before they are distributed or dispatched. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, drop a comment, and subscribe to our channel. You can also turn on notifications to stay updated on new videos on this channel. This brain friend video was brought to you by Sinforest. For more of these amazing e-learning videos, get your copy of Brain Friend. With more than a thousand e-learning videos, over 74,000 test items in more than 40 subjects, a career counseling guide, and many other amazing features, BrainFriend remains your foremost e-learning and exam preparatory software. BrainFriend. Learn better. Make excellent grades.